First thing I want to do is take this foot panel off. It's got four bolts in it, and then it picks right up. I want to be sure to take this plastic guard off so I can see around that easier. Mine takes a half inch. First step I want to do is bring the belt to the back pulley. Got to make sure you stay over top of that support bar right there. Then just lock it in place. The next pulley I'm going to try to put the belt around is that first one I come to in from coming from the back. It's got a pulley guide right there that I can't feed the belt around without taking the pulley off. Looks like the only way I can do it is remove the pulley and then put the belt on the pulley and bolt the pulley back in. To remove that pulley, we're gonna take that nut off right there. It happens to take a 17 or 11 16. Easiest way I found to get support on this bracket so it doesn't move is take this spring off that connected right there and then I just let it push up against that pulley. While you've got this pulley off back here, you need to go ahead and take the remainder of the belt and it's got to go under here as well because it's got to actually run right here. And there's no way to do it once you put the belt and the pulley back on right here. If you don't do it now, you'll have to take the pulley back off. It's, it's got to be on the inside of that guard there. I put it under the bracket and push it up in that guard. And then put the pulley back on. Okay, now by looking at the diagram, we've got it on the back one back there, that's the drive pulley, and we just went through there, got that pulley back on, so we need to come around the outside, all right, come around there, come around on this pulley, then you pull your slack there, and from there, we need to go around that pulley, go around the outside there, around. Then you got to come back through here and go straight back. Now that I've got it on, I want to check, make sure it's riding like it's supposed to on every pulley. And then check the back also. Last thing I need to do is put the tension spring on. Connects from here to right there on this bracket. Watch your fingers there because if you miss that thing will pinch. Don't forget to put my guard back on over here. All right, now we'll put the floor pan back in and crank it up and give it a go. 